uh, mentioned condition, you're, you're familiar with the musculature over the breast. Yes. What, the, why is that important in terms of checking your birds well, are healthy? I can pick a bird up yeah. and I instantly know it's ill because yeah. I can feel the breastbone. Absolutely. And it's like a, it's like a, like a razor. A razor. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And, uh, and the bed might look fine. Yeah. But as soon as you pick it up, and it's usually a bit lighter, and what we we call it going light. Yeah, in the hobby. that's right. Yeah, and we see it in green finches and yes. other birds as uh, well. It's yes. a normal yeah. thing for the yeah. early death. And um, so the muscle's gone. Yeah. That's the first thing that goes when you're ill, isn't it? Yeah. Life. And it's a reminder to mm. our listeners yes. that birds, like other animals, mm. will mask their symptoms, their mm. clinical signs, mm. won't they? Mm. A bird doesn't want you to know it's unwell. No, so, that's right. you know, it's only when you handle it, it, and I do mm. the same. The first thing I do if I have a bird in the hand mm. is feel the keel bone, that's whether it's a small bird I do that or an enormous yeah. one, you that's, know, but that's that's that is part that's of the That's the first thing. If I'm, yeah. and this is a little, uh, when anybody's purchasing a bird, they should handle it. <laughs> yes, yeah. People, I uh, put some birds up for sale, they're like them. I said, well, just hold them. Yeah. Why? I said, well, make sure it's okay. Because I can't tell. I can tell because I've been doing it 57 years. Yeah. I can tell. <laughs> and I can remember one story. This guy was trying to give me a bird, and I refused it. And I did like telling him because I thought, the, well, the bird was ill. Yeah. <laughs> so, and it would have died within two months. But he was trying to give me. And I think, don't, don't buy a bird what's ill. <laughs>